All right, now that you have access to our GitHub organization, you're going to see this Polyhammer build tool workflow repository. Go ahead and click on that. This is a template repository. So go ahead and click use template, give it a name, and make sure you have the permissions set to private. And then go ahead and create this repository in your own account. The reason we have to do this is this add-on actually uses parts of Unreal Engine. We are not allowed to compile parts of Unreal Engine and redistribute that with our code. However, it is perfectly fine for you to access Unreal Engine source code and compile those dependencies yourself. That's why we made this workflow so that you can do that in your own account and build this for your own production. All right, the last thing you'll need to do to get this up and running is you'll need a access token. The simplest way to do this is just to go to our documentation and click on the link that pre-configures the permissions for your access token. However, you can also just copy all the permissions you see here on the screen and create a new token. Once you have that token copied, you're gonna to wanna to go to your repository settings, go to the secrets section, and then you're gonna add a new secret for your action. Name this secret exactly as you see here, GH underscore PAT and then put in the value. And that's it, it's all configured. So from here on out, every time you want to build a new version of the add-on, you're just gonna go to the Actions tab, you're gonna go to the Build section, and then you're gonna click on the Run Workflow. You're gonna choose your product ID, and then you're gonna click Run Workflow. If you refresh, you can see it building. This can take a little bit, maybe even around 15 minutes, but just wait till it's complete, and then you'll see a release pop up on the landing page of your repository. Now just download that zip file, and then drag and drop it into Blender, and you're ready to go.